What's up everybody, it's your boy Jason Yamamoto. Yeah, I know I haven't done this angle in a long, long time. But anyways, I'm about to head out to the gym in a little bit. So anyways, um, a lot of people say that they don't train smaller muscle groups, right? They say, you know, the bicep, the tricep, the forearms, the calves, right? They, want, they only want to do heavy compound movements. The clean, the snatch, you know, the power clean. You know, overhead squats, you know, even powerlifters uh, would do bench press, you know, uh, the squat, the deadlift. And it's all great and fun, right? It's a, it's, that's all it really is. But for the people that says, you know, I don't want to train uh, smaller muscle groups because it's superficial. Why do I need to train the smaller muscle groups? It does nothing for me. All it is is just, I just want to show off my muscle. I just want to look aesthetic, right? So here's the thing, guys. Here's the thing. When you're training, you want to train to be the strongest in everything you do, right? Everything counts. Everything adds up. Everything needs a foundation, right? Just because you only want to train and a specific uh, exercise doesn't mean you can't be stronger everywhere else. Don't close your mind just because you have a philosophy that, oh, training my arms is superficial. I don't want to just have big arms and people think I'm, um, I just lift, you know. I, I want to just surprise people when I just do it. You know, uh, it's a personal philosophy, yes. You can do whatever you want to do. I'm not telling you, but it would behoove you to understand that in order to grow stronger you must grow strong in every area not just in one area right if you want to be the smartest in math you know you don't just study algebra and algebra 2 no you go beyond that trigonometry calculus right that's the same idea why just train in that exercise why just train in that movement train in everything and grow from everything versus just picking one thing and just sticking with it yes can you become really strong with just a straight narrow path yes you can but to say that this is the only way to get stronger is not the right mentality it's a small minded mentality so I invite you guys I challenge you guys to understand when you're training it's not just necessarily just arms I've seen you guys out there freaking arm day 20 you know five days a week weekers you know that's that's you guys you guys need to switch it up man you guys need to switch it up to heavy compound movements as well and try different exercises that's going to challenge your body other than just your arms okay that's it's just weak man i see these um tough martyr guys in the gym doing push-ups and then curls come on man that's just not going to help you guys out in in the long run so much deformity so much uh your postural integrity is not gonna it's not gonna click you understand that but anyways man that's all i have to say for right now I'm about to put on a tank top you know uh get some shoes on and start lifting today's back and buys i want to know what you guys are training today it's your boy jason yamoto and i'll talk to you guys later nice. 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 Nice.